A developing story, both HPD and HISD police working to track down a prank caller after they, after they sparked panic at Heights High School. Now, somebody called in to say 10 people had been shot, but again, it was all a hoax. Brittany Jeffers live on the story from downtown Houston. And Brittany, apparently this was not the only uh, school shooting hoax yesterday. Yeah, that's, that's correct. correct. Uh, this investigation now spanning to several different schools all across the area because they are reporting that this person is accused of calling multiple different schools across Texas. But as you mentioned, uh, we felt that here at home locally yesterday at Heights High School, Houston and HISD police right now working to try to track down a prank caller after they sparked panic at the Heights High School over a possible school shooter. Now, KPRC2 quickly learned that this was a hoax after officers arrived at the school. Authorities there determined that no shots were fired, no one was injured, but they still don't know who was behind that call that created a lot of fear in the area. Officials say that same phone number was used to make fake calls throughout the state, but right now it's unclear who that number belongs to. Houston Police Chief Troy Finner says that when they find out however that person will be held accountable there's also an investigation into this phone call is that correct what is the status Absolutely. what is the status of that call i don't know right now i've been out here uh, i arrived within minutes of the call i'm gonna have to get briefed up on it but as i said earlier it's not a joke and whoever's responsible we're gonna find out and we're gonna prosecute them to the fullest this is not right to many communities dealing with this scare yesterday here in Houston, but also Dallas, Waco, and Pflugerville. Reporting live this morning, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News.